Ice Tells a Story. A story of how Earth's climate and atmosphere have changed over time. To read that story, scientists travel to harsh, remote reaches of the planet. There they drill through thick layers of solid ice. The researchers extract ice core samples and preserve them in frozen laboratories. Look closely at this core. See the layers? Each layer records a season. Add it all together, the layers compile a timeline of Earth's climate history. The longest ice core that scientists have drilled is three kilometers, nearly two miles long. It preserved 800,000 years of information. In the laboratory, scientists melt samples of the ancient ice. They measure the oxygen isotopes to determine how cold it was when the snow fell. Analyzing thousands of samples from a single core shows that Earth's climate has seesawed over the past 800,000 years back and forth from warm to cold. During warm periods, ice sheets melted and sea level rose. During cold periods, massive ice sheets spread. Sea level dropped as water froze into ice. Ice holds more secrets. Not just about past temperature, but about past atmosphere too. When snow falls, it traps air. That air is compressed into bubbles as the snow compacts into ice. In the lab, scientists can tap into the bubbles and measure their carbon dioxide levels. Decades of research revealed that changes in carbon dioxide are linked to changes in temperature. Look at these two graphs. When CO2 increased, temperature went up. When CO2 decreased, so did temperature. Today, CO2 is skyrocketing higher than any time in the past 800,000 years as we burn fossil fuels and cut down forests. This time, humans are the reason Earth's temperature is rising. Just like in the past, the climate is responding to the increase in CO2. Ice is melting. Sea level is rising and storms are becoming more powerful. These rapid changes in climate threaten human lives and profoundly impact all life on Earth. Knowing the story of Earth's climate past can help us prepare for Earth's climate future. What we do now will write the next chapter in the ice.